Hello and welcome to Royal Vibes. Prince Harry sparked a frenzy among his fans after he was photographed in Mozambique without his wife Meghan Markle ahead of his planned trip to the UK. So guys, before we get right into it, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button, turn on the post bell notification so you always stay up to date whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. The Duke of Sussex appears to have travelled to the African Republic of Mozambique. A picture of Prince Harry was shared on Twitter by social media user Eric Maria Genot on Wednesday. The snap shows the Duke smiling as he poses for the photograph while wearing a casual brown polo shirt, a pair of blue shorts and trainers. The Queen's grandson also dons a cap bearing a logo of African Parks, a non-profit conservative conservation organization of which he has been the president since 2017. Mr. Maria Journal didn't say when the picture was taken but captioned it saying Harry is in Vilanculos, a coastal town part of the, you know, in Hambenben province. The Instagram account named Most Paparazzi also recently shared two pictures of the Duke of Sussex, this time seen surrounded by other people in the location on the sea. The Duke's private trip seemingly without Meghan or their children Spark speculation on whether he may have taken a brief holiday with friends or he's on a mission on behalf of one of the organizations he supports. Freelance writer R.S. Um, Loke retweeting these snaps wrote on social media platform Prince Harry wearing his trusty at African Park's hat. Perhaps getting in a bit of travel to Mozambique before he and Meghan venture to the UK next month? In a second message, they said, according to local reports, Harry visited tourist attractions in the Vilanculo region, scouting for travelists and African parks. African parks works on the rehabilitation and long-term management of protected areas in partnership with governments and local communities. On the other hand, travelists and initiatives spearheaded by Prince Harry in September 2019, in partnership with travel giants such as Booking and Skyscanner, aims at making sustainable travel mainstream. In May. This organization launched a holiday raising toll in New Zealand to encourage tourists visiting the country to opt for sustainability and support local communities. These pictures of the Duke sparked a frenzy among his fans with one rejoicing for the privacy enjoyed by Harry during the sacred trip. She tweeted, the ginger lion making silent move once again with trusted people, there is definitely no leaks in Montecito. Another writer wrote, one thing about Harry is he is going to do his own homework about every project he commits to. Another one tweeted, he looks so good. Another added, he moves in silence and I like it. This trip comes just weeks before the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are due to return to Europe. Meghan and Harry were last in the UK in June when they travelled with Lilibet and Archie Harrison to celebrate the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. The pair's next visit will take place in September early September and we'll see them attending events like um, linked to organizations close to their hearts. On September 5, Meghan and Harry will be in Manchester for the One Young World Summit where the Duchess will deliver a keynote speech. Together they will also meet delegates who are working on gender equality. The following day the Sussexes will be in Germany to start the one year countdown to the next Invictus Games in Dusseldorf and on September 8, they will be in London to attend the World Child Awards celebrating extraordinary ill children and young people. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.